The place is covered in blood. We're going to have to get the servants to sort it out. I dread to think what the cleaning bills are going to be like. Still, we've done our duty to the Tsar and Mother Russia. Indeed, we have. It's Rasputin, isn't it? I doubt if he'd knock. Come in! Sorry to disturb you again, gentlemen, but my sergeant has asked me to come back and ask a few more questions. You see, the thing is, there are reports that Mr. Rasputin is nowhere to be found. I don't know what you are implying. Local residents confirmed there was definitely a number of gunshots around 2.37 this morning. But this is ridiculous. Do you realise who I am? I'm really sorry. It's just that my sergeant... Well, you can tell your sergeant that work of national... No, imperial importance has taken place here tonight. The traitor, Rasputin, has been eliminated. <sighs> Every true Russian will drink a toast to our heroic endeavours. Every true Don't Russian. listen to the idiot. He's drunk. He doesn't know what he's saying. Are you drunk, Mr... Uh, Mr... I... I... Yes, I suppose I am. But the suspect was drunk and refused to give me his name. Aren't you that chap from the Duma? Officer, I hope you understand the awkwardness of the situation in which you find yourself. Are you aware that the Tsar himself had given orders that, if it turns out that you and your fellow officers have... Well... I think you know what I mean. I haven't the faintest idea what you're talking about. The Tsarista... Do you presume to speak for the Tsaritsa? I suggest you go back to your silly little police station and think very carefully before you start making any accusations. Do I make myself clear? How do you spell Tsaritsa? Good night, officer. I don't think we'll be seeing you again. Thank you for your help, sir. No problem, officer. Are you out of your tiny mind, Vladimir? We'll never hear the end of it now. I'm sorry. It's been a very stressful night. Come on, let's clean up this mess. Just look at this polar bear rug.